Nancy Allen, a librarian published author and a member of a church corps from Conway, U.S. state of Arkansas, has been wearing hijab for almost two years to support Muslim women and counter hateful rhetoric targeting the religious minority. Everything hit me all at once, Allen told Northwest Arkansas on Tuesday, recalling uh, the then presidential candidate Donald Trump's promise to ban Muslims from entering the U.S. in December 2015. I started challenging or channeling the Lutheran minister and Hitler foe, Martin Neumoller, quote about how the Nazi first arrested socialists, then trade union members, then Jews. Each time Neumoller said I did not speak out because he was not a socialist, a trade unionist or a Jew. Then they came for me and there was no one left to speak for me said Neumiller, who spent seven years in Nazi concentration camps. I had that thought and I was thinking of the poem on the Statue of Liberty, Alan said. It was about that time we were seeing those terrible images of Syrian refugee children being washed up ashore in Europe. Using hijab as a spiritual way to support Muslim women, Alan was afraid that the U.S. might repeat its history of forcing minorities like Muslims to live in internment camps like they did with Japanese Americans during World War II.